Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for November 18th of 2024 is titled Stars and Dust in the Pac-Man Nebula. So what do we see here? Well, here we see part of what is known as the Pac-Man Nebula, and a wider view would show its distinctive shape. But what we're seeing is a star cluster. And in fact, we can see at the center, there is a cluster of stars known as IC 1590. Now those stars are just finishing formation and we're seeing a lot of the material around is the leftover material from their formation. So we still see some gas and dust there. So there's a lot of gas there we can see in the bluish coloration toward the center. And we can see some dark sections of dust as well. Now the very central regions those big globs there are what are known as Bach globules. And those are denser regions where probably new stars are still in the process of formation. So while some of the stars in the cluster have already formed, we can also see those areas where stars are still beginning to condense. Now, as those stars start to form, they will eat away at the rest of the material, pushing it away and eventually clearing out completely this central region. So that process has started, but some of those denser areas still are working on forming stars and may have time to do so before the energy, the strong stellar winds and high energy from these newly formed stars completely erodes away at that dusty material. And in fact, you can see some of that along the edge, especially toward the left hand side of the image, where you can see tendrils pointing in toward the star cluster. At the tips of those is the densest material that has not yet been eaten away. And the less dense material has been eroded and is starting to clear out. Now at those tips, we could form new stars that will also be a part of this star cluster. So the star formation will continue throughout this region while we have the cluster forming at the center. More stars can still form out towards the edges of this as the process continues. So the star formation does not occur all at once, but will slowly work its way through the molecular cloud here forming more and more stars. And as we do and we look at this, eventually the shapes of all of this will change. So if we could come back in a million years or so, most of the gas and dust would be cleared out. We would have more stars having formed and the cluster itself would have cleared out that central area, hollowing it out, leaving behind mainly just the stars and a few wisps left of gas and dust. So that was our picture of the day for November 18th of 2024. It was titled Stars and Dust in the Pac-Man Nebula. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Pointing Clouds. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.